Hi, today I'll be talking about cobalt-60. Radioisotopes are unstable isotopes that decay or break up, giving off high energy radiations and forming different atoms. Cobalt-60 is a very common radioisotope. It has a mass number of 60. Cobalt-60 is produced artificially by a neutron activation. Cobalt-60 emits gamma radiation which is an energetic form of electromagnetic radiation. It is produced by radioactivity. Cobalt-60 has a half-life of 5 years. This is the length of time required for half of the radioisotope to decay. Cobalt-60 can be used in many areas such as industrial and medicine. In medicine, cobalt-60 can be used in radiotherapy, which is used for cancer treatment. It is used in radiation as an external and internal source of radiation exposure. It is used when a patient lies underneath a cobalt-60 machine. The focus between the skin and the machine is usually 80 centimeters. The cobalt-60 therapy unit directs approximately 200 beams of gamma radiation at the patient's tumor. The benefits of cobalt-60 are that it removes cancer cells. Treatment is very fast and it can take several hours or several minutes to complete, depending on the size of the tumor. After therapy is complete, the patient may return to normal everyday activity. It, this, there are some problems associated with cobalt-60. Cobalt-60 is dangerously radioactive when it decays. It can kill healthy cells. It is used once in a person's life. Like all the other radioisotopes, it is very hard to get rid of. Cobalt-60 can also cause death. The benefits of cobalt-60 outweigh the problems because these problems are very unlikely to happen, but they still can happen. The waste of cobalt-60 may be hard to get rid of, but it is not impossible. This is because it has the shortest half-life compared to the other radioisotopes, which means it decays quicker. Thank you.